This is a Maytag Neptune Series TL washer. Just barely over two years old. Just out of the parts warranty. The thing will not spin. It goes completely berserk. As you can see, it'll do that. The sensor will kick in and it'll stop safely. And it'll just continue to spin. So what I've done to work around this issue, and there's a magnetic sensor underneath, and this little locking mechanism requires a certain set distance to be pushed in. So, what I do is with this washer, the problem I've heard described is there's a clutch. And the way to get it to spin is see the, the discs in there, they attempted to spin a little. Well, if the clutch doesn't allow them to engage, for some reason, if they don't completely spin, you can see the dryer's already, or washer is already stopped again. If they don't engage and make a full quarter turn, half turn, they, they lock some way that allows the drum to stabilize, it spins wildly out of control. This isn't a sensor issue. It's a mechanical issue. This is obviously an ongoing problem with Maytag. Now here's my workaround, and I don't recommend this just for anyone, but I've overridden the safety, and if I grab the drum and hold it so that it tries to, you can see the plate's locking, so I'm holding it with my hand. I'm keeping it from spinning because it would want to spin like that. Right before it goes into that spin like that, it tries to turn those, those plates, and when it does, if I hold this, they engage fully. I have to hold the drum with a little bit of pressure, not much, and I'm not putting my hand in any harm's way because even if the thing did take off, it just slips out of my hand. But if I hold that, and you can see it turning them, and I'm holding it here, it's not pulling hard at all. And now watch, they'll go backwards a little, and now they're pulling on my hand pretty hard, not, not too bad, and now they're locked. I can let go. And this is an ongoing problem where it just goes into the 12 minute mark to go into a spin and it simply won't do it. It'll just go berserk. It'll, the machine will slam, the machine will walk. It just won't spin correctly. In fact, I think I held the drama here too long because it's trying to tumble again. So it's going to tumble here. I'm going to take my hand and put it on the edge of the drum to help engage it so that when those try to turn backwards, like that, they lock and I let go to let it spin. And you can see the drum is a lot more stable. And it will complete the spin cycle normally. It wobbles just a little, but that's typical. You normally don't see it because the top lid is locked and everything will engage. So there you have it. There's the uh, quick fix workaround just to uh, magic magnets. Uh, reason for two is I think there's a magnetic sensor on the top and some type of sensor down here. And just the requirement that that can't push all the way out. That has to stop just short. So if it beeps and it won't spin or won't do anything, just push that back a little and uh, should be good to go. But there's my uh, tip for stabilizing the spin cycle on a Maytag Neptune TL model FAV6800 AWW uh, clothes washer. Wish you luck with yours. This one's going to the recycling bin. But at least I'm saving this for a possible class action lawsuit because this is just a, it's a joke. Goodbye.